So a huge shout out to my buddies Voodoo and Chop. I believe you guys are the ones that basically told me in my comments in my video that the PS4 um, had run or ran Linux. And so that basically led me to do some Google searching and get the content and news for this video. So yeah, basically I'm reading an article or looking at an article over at GameSpot um, called PS4 Hacked Video Demonstrates Console Playing Pokemon. And it says, the notorious hacking group Failed Overflow has demonstrated what appears to be the world's first low-level hack of the PS4. As well as bypassing, bypassing the console security measures, Failed Overflow has also managed to write a custom version of Linux for the console and has made the PS4 Linux port publicly available on its website. A video demonstration of the hack also shows the PS4 playing what appears to be a modded version of Pokemon Emerald, renamed as Pokemon PlayStation version. Failed Overflow has been responsible for hacks of numerous consoles, um, being found responsible for hacking Wii, Wii U, and PlayStation 3. The PlayStation 4 has proven to be free from such hacks for more than two years since its release, but late in December, Chaos Communication Congress event, uh, Field Overflow published a five-minute video demonstrating the PS4 running a custom version of Linux. The group appeared to be very impressed by the PlayStation 4's architecture, claiming the Marvel engineers who designed the South Bridge were smoking on some really good stuff. While some hackers advocate the bypassing of console security, as more a hobbyist pursuit, corporations tend to claim that such hacks pave the way for pirated games. So, really awesome. I gotta look into it. As far as I know from another article I read, um, this hack is still only gonna be usable on um, consoles that are before 1.76. It's, I believe, using the web uh, WebKit exploit still. Um, but don't quote me on that. I'll have to do a little bit more looking again. Um, and I also will link you guys in the description to this article and to any videos I can find on this, either demonstrating the Pokemon or the Linux being booted on the PlayStation 4 console. So, hope you guys are excited. This is really cool. It's awesome. This week has actually had some kind of modding, uh, you know, new stuff going on with the DS and now the PlayStation 4. And, uh, yeah, so, anyways, don't forget to like the video, comment down below what you think of it, and I will see you guys in my next video. Dope Swanner, and I'm out. Peace, guys.